Hey, what's up, guys? It's Darkroom Duel. So today I'm going to be opening up some Soul Fusion packs, and quite a few at that. So I was floating around on eBay trying to see, you know, the best deal, as I always do when a new pack comes out, and I happened upon this guy who was selling Soul Fusion packs, um, 24 packs for, you know, $20. And I know a lot of you guys actually, because I saw a bunch of people post about that in Zodiac, uh, Duelist, because I float around out there from time to time, and um, they were kind of skeptical of it, and I was like, well... I'll buy three sets because I have an eBay money back guarantee just like everybody. And I figured, you know, what's the worst that's going to happen? I'm going to end up not losing any money because I'm going to say they didn't come in because they didn't come in correctly. Or when I open them on video, they're going to be tampered with. And I'm going to say, you know, hey, this is not right. They're not correct. I need a return on this. And I'm going to get my money back regardless. So we're going to open up these packs. We're going to hope that they're the way they should be. Um, I know for a fact that they should not have any ultras or secrets in them, or they shouldn't at least, but I know that sometimes we get factory error boxes that have extra ultras and extra secrets, so we might get lucky and pull it. Uh, there is seven, there's three boxes worth right here, so it's like 72 packs right here. I don't know if I'm going to open them all in one video, or if I'm going to do like 24 and then 48. I don't know. We're going to see how quick we go through it. So anyways, guys, I'm going to slide these 48 out of the way really quick. And we'll keep going. I already counted these, so I know I have exactly the amount I should. At least I think I do. And we're going to start opening these guys. So without further ado, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell down there to become a part of the notification squad. And we're going to breeze through some Soul Fusion packs. So let's open pack number one. Let me make a stack off to the side really quick. These should only have supers in them. But that's not a big deal because that's all I really wanted from this set anyways. All the ultras that I wanted were really cheap. And I figured this would be the best deal anyways. So let's see what we can get. So we got uh, Salaman Great Gift, uh, a Dino Wrestler card, uh, Crusadia Crawler, Rise of the Salaman Great, um, Mystric Hunter. So we're just going to kind of breeze through them once we start getting duplicates. Uh, Necker Valley Temple, uh, Patchwork Falafel, Dipexer Chimera, and another Dino Wrestler. So let's go to the next one. Like I said, though, we're going to kind of breeze through this because if I get through a bunch of packs really quick, I might just go ahead and do all 70 two in a video but you'll know in the title uh oh we got the all fair card so we can actually do nordics because nordics are coming ddd flame kingus or uh, flame high gingus uh this card's actually really interesting that we finally got in tcg i'm a little disappointed that's only a common though um salaman great foxy we got Longritsu, the orchestrated um the orchestra card i'm really excited for this because i'm actually going to build this and then we got gravekeeper supernaturalist Seller Grand Great Mirror, uh, Chimera Duplex, and Crusadia Spatha. So, that's pretty cool. I'm really excited for the Grave Keepers. They're, they're a lot of fun. Uh, Emerald Eagle, Salaman Great Gift, Crusadia Crawler, Extra Foolish Burial. And this is another card that I'm really excited that I'm getting a bunch of. Um, then we got uh, Thunder Dragon Matrix, or Thunder, yeah, Thunder Dragon Matrix, Will of the Salaman Great, Galaxy Cleric, uh, Anissimo, and uh, Patchwork. Uh, I really think that Thunder Dragons are actually going to be pretty meta, and I wanted to build them, and I was thinking about building a solid OCG deck of them, like totally Japanese, but, oh, there we go. I'm actually going to pull these to the side. Prank Tops. They're like two bucks each. Um, the Wrestler, Great Ballpark, another one of those things. Uh, we got a um, Brass Bombard. That's pretty cool. Uh, the Range of the Normal, Patchwork. So, um, every one of those Prank Tops that I pull, I'm going to, um, I'm actually going to pull those to the side. So, because they're, they're pretty good. We got the new rank for Link 4, um, Bear Blocker, uh, that, Token Collector, Necrofusion. That's pretty good. I'm really, Necrofusion's actually pretty good. That's going to be used in a lot of decks, I think. Um, I might even try and put it in, um, what's it called? Uh, Predator Plants. So, we got uh, Dogman, Danger Dogman, and Gravekeeper's Headman. Then we get a bunch of more commons. A bunch of orchestrated cards. I better pull some Falgos because I, I really want to build for hires. Uh, Invincibility Bearer, Galaxy Brave, Orchestrated Attack, Galatina. Oh, I'm so excited for her. She's so she's so pretty. Patchwork. There we go. Uh, Spiritualist. I hope I pull like a two play sets of that Patchwork because Savannah needs some Patchworks. So, like, this is going to be a massive opening. Like, seriously. If I start going through these, I'm building those to Noble Knights. They're going to be pretty good. World Legacy, World Wand. I'm getting a bunch of those. Like, maybe that was a really easy card to pull. Like, I bet it was. Like, seriously. That, that was probably a really easy, like, super rare to get. 
Uh, second Adventure into Danger, Consolation Prize. That other DDD card was pretty interesting to pull, too. That uh, Super Doom King Armageddon. It was pretty good. Let's see. High Gingus, Foxy, Prankatops. There we go, second Prankatops. We got the first one of the field spells. That's pretty good. And let me know how you guys like to watch pack opening videos. If you like the people to breeze through them like this, or like if you like us to go a little bit slower and read through the cards. Like I feel like from what I've watched, a lot of people like me to like breeze through them like this. Kind of like, oh, some summon summoner. That's pretty interesting. Eternal Galaxy. Like I feel like people like to breeze through them instead of like watching them for a long time. So we're giving that a shot. Uh, Edge and Cotton Eater. That's pretty good. That's the first one of those. Uh, Thunder Dragon Duo. Thunder Dragon Discharge. Eternal Galaxy. Come on, man. Give me some fall goes. For hires. Uvu. Uvu face. Come on, fall go. Long Grid Suit. There we go. Toll Hike. I feel like Toll Hike might actually be a good card later on. Uh, each player sends one card from their hand to the graveyard and to declare an attack. Like, that might be good in a deck that, like, doesn't care about graveyard stuff. Galaxy Brave, Crusade Crawler, Orchestra Return, uh, Vertical Blaster. Hey, there we go, second patchwork. And we're only, like, a couple of packs in. We're not even through our first box yet, and we got two patchworks. Patchwork's gonna be fun. Like, seriously fun. It's gonna revolutionize the way we play it over here. Let's see, I'm almost through, like, six minutes, and we're almost through our first box. Falgo, yes, and another patchwork. So I got my play set. Oh, I'm going to have so many duplicates. I feel it. Why did I buy three boxes? I should have bought two. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Until Nova Arms were needed again. Necro Valley Tomb. I need those. I need three of those. Spiritualist. I think this is our third spiritualist. Second or third. So. We're doing pretty good so far. I'm, I'm not disappointed that I bought this. Danger Dog Man. Galaxy Transient. That's another deck I'm going to be building on my channel soon. Uh, Galaxies. I had I had the entire deck, and it's actually one of my most viewed deck profiles, like, before Nordics. Um, so I'm going to be building that one very soon. That's, like, really easy to get. Clock Wyvern, too. Like, and plus, you guys get to see, like, the pull ratios. I don't think... I think this is kind of like a short print common. The um, Subservant Stage uh, Dives. I think that that's, like... Um, or divers. I think that that's like kind of short rings. I haven't seen a bunch of those yet. Uh, Orchestrate attack, invincibility bear, danger mothman for the meme. Yeah, now we got. I know I got a bunch of those now. Oh, I got a second one. So I might do all 48 in one video or all 72 in one video because we're only like seven minutes in. And I talked for like two. Nordic, Edge Imp, World Wand, Predoplast, Herald of. Uh, that's the first one of those, Herald of the Abyss. I've only gotten two Prankatops, so Prankatops might be a short print common, because we only we're almost through our first couple of packs. Emerald Eagle, Celebrate Gift, that Duo Matrix. That's not bad. I'm gonna have so much trade bait, like for the commons and the rares and stuff. Until no more armors needed again. Danger Dog Man, and you guys watch too. Tell me if you see anything funny about these packs, because like. I hope there's nothing funny about these packs, but we'll see. It'd be crazy if I pulled, like, a secret rare or something. Like, I'm totally serious. That'd be nuts. Necro Valley Tomb. Got another one of those. I'm going to keep my stacks together. Okay. So that was the first box. Let's go through another 24. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Let's just bust a stack in half. We'll just do a bunch of them. Let's see. Let me count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11... 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Okay, we're going to do another box. Here we go. Because I've got them kind of all pushed up there to the top. Man, I'm getting a stack of packs over here. This is fun. Crusadia Crawler, Solomon Great, Great Ballpark, Harold Lee Biss. That's like the first one of those. Constellation Prize, Necro, whatever. The implications. I'm going to have so many of those implication cards. Like, that's going to be great. So, Salt Man Greats, Mothman, Matrix, Enter the Matrix. I actually have a trench coat that I wear all the time and I look like I'm from the Matrix. If you guys have ever seen me at, like, uh, anime conventions, because I go to a lot of them, like, I always wear, like, a trench coat if it's cold out. So, anyways. Emerald Eagle, World 1, Extra Foolish Barrel. I think that's only the second one we pulled of those. So, 
that's not too bad. Two is not bad, I guess. I don't know how short those are, but they might be short print supers. So, oh, we got another Galatina. There we go. And that's the first Heat Leo I've pulled. So, it's kind of weird. We're going to do a quick little test, and we're actually going to count the cards on the back. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, yeah. So, anyways, we got another Frank Tops, and we got another Falgo. So, that was, like, one of the best packs. Let me put these in the right spot. Hold up. I'm probably putting these all mixed up, but I don't care. I'll sort them after the video. I hope I pull, like, a play set of all the orchestrated cards, because I really want to build orchestrated cards, but it's not looking like I'm going to, so I might have to spend, like, 99 cents to get them, but whatever. We'll see. Let's see. Panzer. That's the first one of those Noble Knights I pulled, so... That's kind of interesting. The Goki Pawns, though. Oh, my God. Is this like Weevil Underwood, the pack? Or Goki Poles, or whatever they are. Like, back in Battle City Arc, he gave some duelist that to kind of, like, get him to do what he wanted to do. I remember that. That was kind of weird. I think he was, like, luring Joey Wheeler to, like, some sort of place. And he wanted to, like, sucker him into dueling. So, that was kind of weird. Some Summon Summoner. Uh, Sign Up Fusion. I think that's the second sign up fusion. Token collector is pretty cool card though. I really like that. Barrier, Brave, Crusadia, Galatina, that's our third one. I think I've gotten two long Gritsus. So. Oh yeah, this is fun. Oh, Prangatops right on the front. Maybe it's a good pack. Some summon summoner. Spiritualist. That. I don't know. This is kind of fun just busting through packs i mean especially when you only pay like 80 cents a pack it's not bad uh extra foolish barrel and a patchwork that's my fourth patchwork so patchwork does not seem to be a hard one to pull and neither does prank tops because like prank tops is like that's the fourth one of those fifth one never mind just as i say it for those of you who've made it this far and at the end of the video, I'm kind of going to flip through the supers and stuff. So, we'll get a kind of like a recap. A little bit. But that doesn't mean skip to the end. Oh, we got a third fall go. Yes. Okay. So, I think we're making good time, too. I'm going to have to make a second stack of commons. A grave, brave, her, that... Let me make another stack of commons. Before they fall everywhere. Oh my god. This is a lot of cards. Extra Foolish Burial. Oh, we got a first one of those. Cool. Yes. Orchestrated Heart Horror. So, I think I've gotten one of each of the orchestrated cards. So, that's not too bad. Let's see, Galaxy Brave, Falgo, we got another Falgo, and another uh, Trance, or whatever it is, Galaxy thing. I'm gunning for a play set of everything, but I think with three boxes, that shouldn't be too hard. Another Prank Tops, aha, duo, oh, we got another one, yes, we're doing pretty good. I've got like 24 more packs to go. Maybe I will pull a play set, I don't know, we'll find out. Brass, come on, be Brass Boomer. Yeah, oh, wow, I called that. <laughs> I mean, it's not a lot of cards in the set, but still, I called that. That was pretty cool. So, it's looking like I'm going to build Orchestrated. Or Orchestra, or whatever they are. They were called, like, Orphagal in the OCG. So, that's pretty cool. We got the Necro Valley. I think that's all my Necro Valley tombs I need. Or all the Necro Valley thrones I need. So, I need just Harp Harrs. And the other one, and I should be good, I think. But I'll take as many Galatinas as this box will want to give me, because I love that artwork. And the backstory for her is so sad, too. So, whole hike, that. It's kind of weird, because like, sometimes I'll get three in the back, and sometimes I'll get two in the back. So, it's kind of weird. So, Brave, Duo, that, those... 
I don't think I breeze through Brankatops. As of right now, we have six Brankatops in three boxes, or two boxes. So that's not bad. That's like a play set of box. So that's really not terrible. Salaman great. Oh, we got a Harpar. Yes. Okay. So last box. We're just going to do them all in one video. We're just going to do all 72. We're going to call this the massive Soul Fusion video. Because we're only 15 minutes in. We can do 20 minutes. Let's go. Sell man grade. Oh, we got a prank tops and a Galatina and an orchestrated thing. So there we go. And tell me what you guys think of these pack openings. I know these don't do very well on my channel for some reason. I don't know why, but they never really have taken off Falgo. Um, but they never have really taken off. I don't know why. It's like deck profiles are my niche. So, I mean, I'll take it. I like doing deck profiles more than pack openings, but you kind of got to do the maintenance of getting the packs to get the cards. You know what I mean? A grave Herald. Supernaturalist, other stuff. So, Brave. I'm actually getting like arm cramps from opening these because I'm doing it so quick. Let's see. 20 straight minutes of pack opening, first world problems. <laughs> Danger Mothman, Heat Leo. That's only our second Heat Leo that I've seen. Maybe it'll get a reprint in the Mega Pack or whatever it is. Because I know you have to like summon it twice or something. I'll go. Patchwork. Haha. It's fan, it's looking like you're going to get patchworks. I only got to get one more out of like 20 something packs. Let's go, boy. Extra Foolish Burial. Come on, give me a Colossalus. Like, let me get a random Colossalus, please. Like, from a misprint box where the guy like missed a secret. That would be crazy cool. All right, Predaponics or whatever it is. Let's see, let's see. Got another one him, another one him. It seems like um, if you're gonna get a Frankatops, it's gonna be either in the front or in the first couple of like cards. Yeah, like see, like right there. I got another one, but it's not ever gonna be back here in the back for some reason. And I don't know why they do this. Like sometimes you get three in the back, sometimes you get four in the back. Like I'm noticing that like trend. See, I got like three in the front that time. I got him and I got three in the back. I got four in the front and I got three in the back, which was kind of weird. And then this next pack is going to be like four in the back, three in the front for commons. Like one, two, three super, two, and then four in the back. See, it's kind of weird. I don't know if you guys noticed that. But none of these packs that I could tell were tampered with at all. But who knows? You guys might catch something that I don't. See, there's three right there. That's kind of weird. But... I think I'm getting the nine cards per pack. Let's do another test. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we're getting nine. So let's just pull these out really quick. Galatina. Maybe I'll have the front end. Maybe I'll have enough Galatinas that I can uh, outfit the front of a binder. That'd be pretty cool. Like all I gotta do is have like three plus eight because I need three for the deck, and then I need eight for the front. Hey, there we go. I'm getting them. She heard me. I'm gonna dollar up on the front of a binder. It's gonna be great. Don't know how many I've gotten so far. I think I need like one more long grid too. I think, maybe. Throne, burst. Oh my goodness, this is a lot of packs. Long grid too, here we go, Harpar, there we go. Okay, let me move these uh, commons out of the way and we'll keep going, just give me a second. All right. Oh, man, that stack is almost as tall as the TV of empty packs, break tops. Dogman, Transient. Come on, Colossalus or Titan or something. I need something crazy. I know they're guaranteed supers, but why do I do that? I know they're guaranteed supers, but who knows? Crazier things have happened. I've gotten a ghost rare out of a 10. That was fun. That was before I started recording on YouTube. Oh, I think I got all those. I think I just need like two more. I think I need like one more hard par and one more of the um, brass base or whatever it is. And I've got them all. Oh, I think I just need a hard par. I think I need one hard par and I got it. Come on, I got five packs. Give me one hard par, please. That's all I ask. One. Hard par. Oh my god, I called it. Oh, that was awesome. Come on, you gotta give me a like for that. I called it. 
I said I needed one, and the packs gave it to me. We going we going to make Orphigal. We are going to make Orphigals. All right, this is going to be the pack right here. This is going to give me a, a what's it called? Uh, the 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 no, it's not. It's going to be a Thunder Dragon duo. I was going to say a Colossalus. All right, we got two more packs. We got two more packs, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking about saving that last pack, where I don't open it. Well, yeah, I probably will. I probably won't. I'll probably just open it, because she needs one more patchwork. Why not? I'll just open it. Let's just do it. If I want to get Soul Fusion, it's going to be something that's going to be in print for a long time, so let's just open it. Be patchwork. Be a patchwork. All right, so we're going to actually go slower through this one. Rise of the Salamangrate, Prank Tops, Duo, Matrix. Not, not what we needed, but hey, we get everything else we needed. So let's do a quick recap, guys. That was pretty awesome. That was probably the most fast and furious I've ever done for a pack opening. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of Frank Tops, which is awesome. I hope I'm saying that right. And then let's see if we got our entire Orphogol core really quick. Uh, we got that, that, that. We got those three. We got another Harp Horror. Let's see. Come on. Come on. Let's pull our patchworks out, too. Let's pull patchworks out. Throw them up to the top. Let's see if we got it. I'm not... I, the field spell you only need, like, one of, I think. Maybe two. Okay, if I pull, like, one more each, we're, we're solid. Oh, I pulled, like, four hard bars. Never mind. Another one of those. Got that. I know I pulled one of those other ones right at the beginning. So, I think we're good. There's two of those. And there's one of those. Yeah, we got it. We actually got one more extra. These are really weird. Like, I'm surprised that these, like, you pull, like, only two of those. That's stupid. So, let me check for Galatinas. We'll count the Galatinas and flip through the Supers. And we'll be good. But you only need, like, two of these anyway, so. The Babel. So, that's fine. So, we got... All these supers, we got a long gritsu right there. Galatina, Galatina. Let's see, keep flipping, keep flipping. We got plenty of fall goes. I know I got plenty of fall goes. Long gritsus, not so many long gritsus, but I know I got every long gritsu I need. I'm glad I actually did buy three because I wouldn't have got everything I needed if I wouldn't have bought three. But it was just like twenty dollars a box. It was it was super cheap, guys. Like really, really, really cheap. There we go. We got them. We got them. Long Gritsu was like short print, super it looked like. But we actually walked away with six of the um, Galatina. And we actually walked away with three of the Long Gritsus. The orchestrated orchestrator. So, anyways, I think we did good, guys. I'm really glad that I bought these. Like, that was a lot of cards. Like, a lot of cards. And I'm going to do something that not every other YouTuber will do. Uh, I'm actually going to show you the stack of like carnage <laughs> and then we're going to end the video so before you guys don't forget to like comment subscribe i really enjoyed showing you this video guys it's a lot of fun um let me show you the carnage that we had really quick that is the carnage of the packs but uh anyways guys this is dark arm duels i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next video soul fusion concluded be on the lookout for nordics uh orchestra uh grave keepers all sorts of decks we got a bunch of decks in store now fluffles i've got so many decks to build now but anyways guys don't forget to like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video and for all those packs please give me a like i'll see you guys later